What about your own fundraising? Because Pantera Capital is one of the main players out there if you want to get into digital space. You're still looking at raising, what, an 175 million fund? Yeah, so we had a first close of that uh, this summer and we're targeting a second kind of final close at the end of the year. Is appetite still there from people who want to put money into this space? Yeah, appetite's still there, especially on the venture and equity side. Because these markets, you know, people want to invest in equity when the crypto prices are down and vice versa, you know, when the opposite scenario is true. People kind of follow the opposite of the cycle, even though the rational thing might be to put more money into crypto assets now and maybe buy equity later. So are you finding it a non-correlated asset or not? Um, do you mean do you like the regular markets? Yeah. It's, it's still pretty low correlations. I mean, e even at the highest points, crypto only goes up to about 0.2 relative to assets like the S&P or gold. So that's a great uh, point that he's making where there hasn't really been correlation. But I actually think because crypto is kind of like a commodity that in the future, if there is major uh, debt problems and another uh, debt crisis and a debt bubble bursting, um, there's going to be a flood of uh, money towards commodities, but also I believe crypto assets. So it's really important to understand this because um, and obviously this trend has not really been proven. So only time will tell. But I would definitely pay attention to it, and especially if interest rates keep going up, I do see a lot of growth in the crypto assets while the stock market and real estate markets suffer. And we're kind of seeing that right now. The stock market is very shaky, very volatile. So if you have a chance, I would take some of your profits out if you are making good profits or you have made good profits in the stock market and I would consider buying some crypto assets. I wouldn't do your entire portfolio but definitely have some exposure, have some diversification in crypto assets and be very careful with the stock market and definitely in this position I, I would also say that fiat or cash could be king um, so you can take advantage of buying both dips. But let me know what you guys think about this and I will talk to you guys soon.